The attorney of the Federation and the Minister of Justice, Abuba Kamalami, has agreed to appear before the House of Representatives Committee investigating the missing 48 million barrels of crude oil. The chairman of the committee, Mark Bila, Labour Party Benway on Thursday announced that Mr. Malami, who had ignored previous invitations, will appear before the committee on 27th April after the public holiday. And he said Mr. Malami wrote a letter to the committee that he will cooperate with the panel and provide needed information on the ongoing investigation. Malami must provide comprehensive report while acknowledging receipt of the letter, Mr. Gila says. And the AGF must provide a comprehensive report to support the work of the committee. He explains that the finance minister has continued to ignore the summon, but that the committee is still giving her the benefit of doubt. While we appreciate the Attorney General's response, we would like to indicate that it came a lot later than we expected, and it came without the response referred to. So we'll appreciate it if the Attorney General and Honorable Minister of Justice provides this response and to also appear before the committee next week, uh, Thursday. So let's give him the window to appear before the committee. Unfortunately, the Honorable Minister of Finance has still been evasive. The committee has not received any submission or response from the Honorable Minister of Finance. The Accountant General sent a response and has not responded to our follow-up because we have asked further questions to what he provided us information about. And there are other entities we have scheduled. I believe the NNPCL should be appearing before us also next week. But we want to call on the Honorable Minister of Finance to, like the Attorney General, show regard and respect for the separation of powers as enshrined in our constitution and respond promptly to the request of the committee so that we can get to the bottom of our investigation. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.